welcome to another two minute top tip to help you make those difficult conversations less stressful and more successful. And today I'm asking a question from Mr. S in Essex and he's asked, how do you structure a difficult conversation for success? Well, if you're wondering the same thing, then you are going to love today's tip. So difficult conversations by their very nature are tricky and hard work. And if you don't go in with a structure or framework in mind, you can find that they're just not as successful as they can be. I use a structure called STORM. STORM is an acronym and it's got five parts I'm gonna quickly take you through now. The first is state the issue. Explain to someone why you need to have this conversation and what you're hoping to get from it. The second is then Go to them, ask them what they think, what their side of the situation is. Then hopefully you can start to talk about options. How could we solve this before coming to R, the resolution? What is going to change? What are they going to do? What are you going to do? And then the final piece, M, move on and follow up. In this, you want to make sure you arrange a time just to touch base and see how things are going. If you go through those five sections of STORM to structure a difficult conversation, you'll find it should go a lot better. Now, today it's a two minute top tip, but I have got a great resource I'd like to point you to. And that is a short e-course where I take you through in a little bit more detail each of those five stages. You can get it at ukheadsup.com forward slash STORM. So that's how you can structure a difficult conversation for success. Give it a go and let me know. And if you've got a question that you'd like me to answer to help you make those difficult conversations more successful, then pop along to ukheadsup.com forward slash rsonia and I will be happy to.